Good morning, good morning. So today I'm going to share to you how I make my own probiotic plant microorganism. What is plant probiotic microorganisms? Plant probiotic microorganisms PPM, also known as bioprotectants, biocontrollers, biofertilizers, or biostimulants are beneficial microorganisms that offer a promising alternative and reduce health and environmental problems. Equipments needed. 1. Molasses. Molasses is high in calcium, magnesium, iron, potassium, and other micronutrients. These readily available nutrients act as a quick fertilizer for plants. The sugar in molasses is a food source for beneficial microorganisms found in soil. Healthy soil leads to healthy plants. 2. Yakult. It provides nitrogen and phosphorus to the soil without leaving any harmful artificial compound. Mix it with water in 50 to 50 ratio and pour it around roots of the plants once or twice in a month. The application of yogurt will improve the plant's nitrogen intake ability. 3. One liter of water not chlorinated. Killing bacteria is a good idea for humans, but not necessarily when it comes to water. For plants, and since nutrient solutions are typically calibrated with purified water, the best way to maximize their benefits is to make sure water is chlorine and chloramine free. Additionals, empty container, funnel, measuring spoon and gloves. So yung unang gagawin natin guys is ilalagay natin yung one bottle of Yakult sa isang one liter of water. So pwede lang yung tap water lang, yung sa gripo lang, basta hindi siya masyadong chlorinated. Tapos mag-add na tayo ng 100 ml na molasses. Tapos ang ininext natin is imimix natin sila. Halo natin ng mabuti. Tapos pag nahalo na natin ng mabuti, pwede na natin siyang isa lang dun sa empty bottle na container or any container lang na pwedeng paglagyan. Tapos yung application naman niya sa mga tanim is kumuha lang tayo ng 1 tablespoon of the PPM that we made tapos ihalo natin siya sa 1 liter of water. Tapos yun na, pwede na natin siyang i-apply sa ating mga plants. So, parang magsisilbi to siyang um, antibiotic sa ating mga plants. Kasi, I did this dahil nag-undergo ng um, mga infection yung tanim dahil sa mga pests that surrounds the area like yung aphids, yung mga lip miners kaya nag-apply ako ng probiotic. Though I already applied OHM nag-spray na ako ng OHM sa mga plants na to which is also an organic way to kill or to to avoid pests, leaf miners, or kahit anong um, mga pest na pwedeng dumapo sa mga tanim natin. So, yan. So, thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. And I gained this knowledge of making PPM from reporter na magsasaka YouTube channel. And, guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video. You could also comment down below kung meron pa kayong maisasuggest or correction dun sa ginawa kong PPM. So, thank you so much, guys. And I hope to see you again in my next video. Bye!